Hello and welcome to another Stack Team App Help video. In this video, we'll share how to use the Surveys feature, which allows you to send surveys to your members or the general public. The Surveys feature allows you to survey members with easy to set up options for multiple choice or free form replies. You also have the option to share your responses or keep them private. You can also download a CSV file with all the data of any surveys created. Once you've watched the video, it'd be great if you can give it a thumbs up Subscribe to our YouTube channel and also hit the alerts button so you get notified when we upload future videos. Surveys are easily set up. You can send a notification to your members once the survey is open. Members will also be prompted to respond to your survey when they launch your Teams app. If your members have been manually added via email and don't use the app yet, they'll get an email version of your survey and can complete it once they become registered Stack Team app members. Surveys can be set up either through the app or the website dashboard. First, we'll show you how to do it from the admin dashboard, which, which you can access at stackteamapp.com. Once logged into your dashboard, click on the surveys feature. In the next screen, to create your first survey, click on the plus symbol. Then give your survey a title and enter a description of the survey. This is optional. Then choose a start and end time for the survey. Then choose the level of access. You can make the survey open to the public, approve members, or select their access groups. Then you can set up your questions. Click the green plus symbol to create your first question. Type in the question, select if you want the answer to be mandatory, leave choices below and turn off other option if you want a free form answer. If you want choices, click the green plus and type in the answer. Then if you want more choices, click the other green choice buttons and repeat the steps. You can also tick the box below if you want to have the word other as an optional response. Once done, if you want to send a notification or not, select below, then press save. If you would like to download the data from any surveys, click into the survey, then press the three dots to the right. Choose CSV report and click download CSV file button. Now we'll show how to create a survey using the app, which is very similar to the dashboard version. Go to Stack Team app, then open your app then choose surveys from the main menu. If you can't see the feature, turn on the feature via the app settings button in the app menu. To create your survey, click on the plus symbol at the top. Then give your survey a title and enter a description of the survey. This is optional. Then choose a start and end time for the survey. Then choose the level of access. You can make the survey open to the public, approve members or selected access groups. Then you can set up your questions. Click on the green plus symbol to create your first question. Type in the questions, select if you want the answer to be mandatory, leave the choices below empty and turn off other option if you want a free form answer. If you want choices, click the green plus and type in the answer. Then, if you want more choices, click on the other green plus buttons and repeat the steps. You can also tick the box below if you want to have the word other as optional response. Once done, if you want to send a notification or not, select below and press save. Thanks for watching another Stack Team App Help video. As always, if you have any further questions about any of our features, please contact us via stackteamapp.com and we'll be glad to assist.